Everything is fuck it mentality today. Welcome back to my channel today i am super chill as you can see no makeup no jewelry we are just in my bedroom because if you haven't seen posting online and stuff and whatever especially on tiktok counting down the days until august off and it is august and i am not working and i'm very happy about it but also a little stressed <laughs> this year around but that's for a whole different reason and we love the economy we just love it it's way to make everything better than to shop but before i show you guys everything everything that I bought. Um, I do have a special announcement that I'm very excited about. I, <laughs> I've been teasing about this in vlogs and stuff, so you probably already know. I've officially decided to go back to school. I'm going back to school this year, and I'm very excited, very nervous. I have not been in school, in college, since fall of 2018 I believe yeah so it's been a very 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 long time and a lot of stuff has changed and this was a whole process I've just had a whole thing I've had to re-enroll and just here we are we're trying to we're trying to make everything better obviously a girl went a little crazy but I also got some other things too that I wanted to share with you guys so if you want to see what I got watching and if not I don't know what to tell you this is what it is so bye uh let's just jump right into this the most exciting part this is like a sneak i know you're probably like sam it's august it's not even fall yet pink dropped their halloween collection and this year i was into it i am very picky about halloween stuff if you're new here hi i'm sam i'm scorpio i'm a fall baby i love the summer as well i'm very particular about halloween stuff i like it to be very simple black and I was gonna say black and white <laughs> black and orange just I'm really into like I don't like all the gimmicky stuff that comes with Halloween maybe it just stems from my childhood I just really love original OG Halloween movies shows decorations clothing that's just me that's just what I prefer crew socks and I have a cute little heart jack-o-lantern and a little ghosty so cute I'm so excited to wear these you have no idea I'm trying to get into wearing more crew socks and stuff or I was in the fall and winter last year my nose is itchy oh my gosh don't say it thank you and then this is random but I got a boy short panty very random this was all from online this I've had two of these in the past both the same design but they came out with it in a pink <laughs> I haven't worn a onesie in a very long time but this was just so cute and I'm so happy that pink offers like XL and and you know goes up sizes now very stretchy it's pink skeleton vibes this is what I'm gonna be for Halloween while I'm sitting in my house because it's out of school night hate that so much although if you guys were here last year when I was literally sick the whole last week of October early November I didn't go to work on Halloween last year, so. Okay, and then the other couple things I got, I got these PJ shorts, which now I'm looking at them like these are gonna be really massive, but they're orange and on the back it has the hands, the classic hands. I used to have the tank top with the hands on, you know, the boobs and it would say hands off in the back. I miss all my old Halloween stuff, honestly. Like, I really do. When your brain is that foggy, it just got really bright. Hi, guys. How are you? Halloween PJ pants, they all have little spider webs all over them very cute this is also in an xl i don't know i bought i feel like i bought them too big but i don't know i feel like their xl runs really big and they're large sometimes is perfect for me and sometimes it's too big i don't know the sizing's a little weird that's all the stuff i got from pink i also got a fresh and clean body mist that's in the other room like a new one because i still have the one from like 2016 that i love so much and i ended up getting a new one last night i went to ulta i returned a whole bunch of stuff so i ended up getting just a couple things this is for my trip to maine we are leaving sunday today's friday so i got a not your mother's defining curl talk cream i've been really liking this to put in my hair after i shower and like scrunching it a little bit or even just using this to style before i go out just to like give it a little scrunchiness or something i don't know my hair is just really natural and i don't know what it's doing right now because I took it out of a clip and it's she's being crazy I don't know if that's how you're supposed to use it probably not but um I'm trying to get my waves back in my hair and I know it's probably really hard because my hair is really bleached 
I don't know. Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder. I love this. This is in Fairlight. I'm again going to mix this with the light just because I feel like, again, it's still too dark for me. Their shade range of these powders sucks. I'm sorry, Maybelline. Love you, but your shade range sucks. I wish there was a shade in between 10 and 15, like a 12 or a 13. I feel like that would have been perfect for me. But got another waterproof mascara. This one just so happens to be the Essence Lash Princess, just cause mine is getting a little gross. And things I got from Target, clearly. They changed their bags, by the way. We are no longer this one. We are moving on to this one, at least in the state of Connecticut. I went to Target yesterday with um, one of my best friends, Alba, and I got this, oh, hello. I got this holographic pouch for my pens. Now, all, all the classes I am gonna be taking are going to be online, cause I just don't want to do that. No, like I just don't want to do that. I don't want to do the commute. I'm sorry, I just don't. I'm not gonna complain. She's gorgeous for using her for all my pens and highlighters and stuff. I went a little crazy, <laughs> you guys will see. This is also really random, but I don't have a really nice pair of boots. Like I do, I have like a camel, I think it's camel colored, like beige, very light beige colored boots that I love, but I wanted a black pair and I couldn't find one that I liked. I just ended up buying these randomly from Target and I love these. These are so cute. So I got these boots. They're kind of like rain boot vibes, but also not. Like you could wear them whenever, not just to work, but I don't know. Now that I'm a para, like, <laughs> like I've said in the past, I just want to dress more professional. I'm actually going to be getting rid of some t-shirts that I was wearing because they are not, not it. They are very bad. <laughs> demi boots. There we go. These are the demi boots. Very cute. I really like these. I think these are gonna be great for the fall and the winter and to just like look cute and stuff. I wanna put together some outfits this fall. I don't wanna be just so comfy, but we'll see. I literally totally transformed this planner. So this, it did not come like this. This is my own planner covers and discs that I bought myself, but I got myself a new planner. It says, hello, this happy planner belongs to, this is one of the new ones I think they have it at Target. I believe they do. It's the new 2023-2024 one. This is the Happy Planner. I used to be so down for this and then I think, I don't know, somewhere in summer, the end of summer 2021, I was over it and I didn't want to do it anymore. I forgot how much I love planners. Like, oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. Literally decorating every single month like I used to with all my stickers. Okay, this is, I don't know if there's anything I bought in here. Maybe there is. I don't know. Oh, this is all my stuff that I have prepped for the school year so I'm just gonna show you guys this briefly well since I got a new pouch this one I've had since high school this pouch but in here I just I bought actually no these are all my old stuff from when I was in school and I put some new pens in here customized pens that say my name on them that have like a little autism puzzle my little pencil one but I've got highlighters in here some post-it tabs for books and stuff, um, white out, you know, do you name it? Cause I didn't really know what was gonna happen. So I just kind of threw my old stuff in here. I went through my old backpack and you guys, crazy, just crazy vibes. I bought two more of these little post-it tabs. I love these for books and for keeping track of things, especially to mark chapters or to mac mark, mac, okay. Mark important notes and stuff like that. Although I do hopefully plan to do most of my notes and stuff obviously on my computer since I am going to be doing online classes. My old, I can't show it to you. I directly cannot show it to you, but I can show you my brief little picture. Terrible from when I went to school in my pink lanyard throwback. I just have a lot of random stuff in here. I have another notebook that I bought from Amazon. I've got some other like papers and biters I gotta go through. I honestly, guys, never thought this would happen for me. Like I just really was in the mindset of like, eh, I'm not gonna go back to school. It's such a waste of time, waste of money, especially with the student loan things. Like I was like, this is such a waste of time and money. But I don't know, I don't know. I just really wanna better myself. I'm really into my self growth and wanting to be better. And if that means going back to school, I'm going the back to school at 30 years old. I don't give a fuck. Back to stuff that we actually did buy. Um, <laughs> I got some dry erase markers for my calendar in our bedroom. Dry erase board on our fridge and I write like our weekly menu so I can better plan meals and stuff. These are not back to school at all whatsoever. Found them on an end cap and I couldn't walk away. I could not do it. Might also come as a shock to you guys, but I'm getting rid of all my Bath and Body Works candles because they just, they are not 
<laughs> I love them, but they just give me such bad headaches now. I cannot burn them for more than like an hour, maybe 30 minutes at a time. And I feel like it's just such a waste. So I'm actually going to be donating them. A lot of them are almost done burned. Some of them are barely even burned. Some of them I haven't even burned. So I'm like, you know what? Would someone else can get better use out of them that can handle them. I can't. I prefer the TJ Maxx ones. DW can't. DW Home is really great. I love the Village Candle from Maine. Um, Opal House from Target makes really good ones too. So I got a little one called Fall Day because it smelled really nice, but I <laughs> wasn't sure if... Gooby's playing with the string for my boots. That's fine. I wasn't sure if I was gonna love this in like a full size candle. So I got a tiny one and then I got pumpkin pancakes, which smells like pumpkin cupcake. Oh my gosh, she smells. Oh my gosh, I'm already in fall and I'm just going on my summer vacation. Make it make sense. Make it make sense. This nail polish because I thought it was really pretty. This is a LA Girl Gel Extreme Shine Gel Like Polish. I'm gonna paint that on my croissants or my toes. Very excited for that. Last thing in this bag, I bought another one of these. I've had these in high school. I've had them in college before. The ones that I saved, I have so much old school supplies, you guys, that you're probably like, why didn't you just, because I could not. <laughs> A lot of the two that I did have of these were all broken and bent and just, it was time to move on. But I got another one of these. This is a five star flex hybrid note binder. It includes five tab divider, 60 sheets of paper. Cover folds over to lie flat like a notebook and I guess you can I think you can use this with the app there's like a special app that you can I don't know if you can do it with this oh maybe it's not this but I know that there's a special notebooks now that you can buy and you can download an app from five star and it will all go on your phone or your tablet or whatever which I think is really awesome however I don't have that but that's okay I don't really care I'm super excited to like decorate this and make it my own and like oh my gosh like I just I love school supplies I've always loved school I've just honestly you guys know from my journey going to college and I've talked about it here on my channel before I just had a hard time with my anxiety and pressure and stuff like that in my 20s so now I'm hoping that I'm 30 and I have a better mindset and I'm like okay we have tasks we need to get done we're going to do it stop it we're not procrastinating we are not doing that to ourselves we love ourselves we want to better ourselves we are not going to do that this time so this stuff just makes me really happy it's gonna be different this time it's gonna be good and I'm very excited kind of the fun stuff I'm not gonna lie um I got a couple clothing I don't not I got more than a couple let's be real I got another pack of little hoop earrings I've been liking to wear these just every single day and not take them out so some of them have gotten tarnished I broke a pair so we got these I definitely want to invest in like a really nice like gold set maybe someday that won't tarnish and I can constantly wear them but until that day target pairs of underwear you guys probably don't care about that but I got them from jockey because I wanted to try these ones I'm also trying to revamp my whole underwear drawer it's a whole thing because the ones that I used to wear from that I wear from Amazon I like them but I'm kind of getting over them now so we got a couple pairs and it's this nice cute little like mauvey purple color some people are worried about clothes that's why I'm not like or weird about underwear so I'm not like throwing it in your face. Bralette that was on sale, also from Jockey. I really like the Jockey brands, really nice. So I got another one of those because they're very comfy and sometimes I just want to wear those. And I got two of these Jockey tank tops because you could literally put them with anything. You can lounge in them, you can wear them out, you can dress it up. So I got a gray one as well. By the way, if you hear paper noises, that is Goober. So she's just living her life over there. Couple of these ripped t-shirts. I originally bought three of these and had to return them and get a smaller size because they're so big. But this is what they look like. They're just like ribbed. They just look nicer and more professional because the ones that I bought from Old Navy, I'm, they're gone. I'm done. They're going away. Like they're so stretched out and so awful. And I'm like, why did I wear these for a whole year? And I just got it in black as well. They didn't have gray and large. We'll wait for another day. Pair of jeans. I love jeans. <laughs> I feel like now that I've like started working out and I'm, trying to tone up my body and stuff, I really just appreciated a good jean, especially on my booty. Den, Denny, I'm gonna say it wrong, Denizen from Levi's, high rise skinny. I originally bought boyfriend ones, wasn't really a fan of the cut, of the fit. I'm just, I'm a skinny jean girl, I try. I do have like really oversized like cargo-y jeans that I will wear on occasion. I will wear them. I don't know. There's just something about a skinny jean that makes my heart happy and these fit me so perfectly. 
that I just, oh, I love them. And look at the curve. Like, I just, I love the way these are curved, too. They're stretchy and nice, and these are in a 14M, if you guys are wondering. That's what I wear. I'm a size 14. I'm not ashamed to share it. Because I'm a big girl. Everything that I got for back to school, obviously, I lied to you guys. That was not the last haul for now. I'm just never going to say that again. We're going to just delete that title. It's not even that title anymore. Um, we're just going to go with it. So, severe thunderstorm warrant watch. Oh, cool. Hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I will be doing more videos again. Yeah, I know I've been a little stagnant here on my channel lately. I've just, I don't... I have no excuse. I feel like I get in these moods where like I'm pumping out videos and I'm like, yes, I'm going to do this and I'm going to do this and I'm going to do this. But I'm literally just following my heart and doing what makes me happy. So hopefully you guys are enjoying that as well. I definitely want to do a video cleaning out my car because Bean needs a good clean. I got to vacuum her. She needs to go back through the car wash again. Like I'm not even kidding you guys. It is bad. It is very bad. My garbage is filled with protein bar wrappers. It's just... Fun, fun time. I need a new freshie too. So add that to the list for the future. I love you guys so much. Hope you have an awesome day. Subscribe if you want to see more of me. Like this video if you enjoyed. Turn on bell post notifications so you know when the f I post a new video because I don't even know anymore. Ha! Ha ha! I'm trying though. Don't get me wrong. I am trying. We will get there. Um, next week I will be in Maine, but I'm planning on having a video scheduled hopefully for Wednesday. And then the week after, obviously... One of, my, one of my best friends, Nate, is going to be here, so I don't know how videos are going to go that week. But we're going to do our best, and then I got one more full week, and then I go back to work. <laughs> I know. Me too. Me too. It's like it just started, and it's it feels like it's going to end, and like, yeah. I don't know. But I love you guys, and I hope you have Stop. No. Stop. But I love you guys, and I'll see you in my next video.